tutorial number 14 in my series of tutorials on using pictures to exe series 8 tutorial 14 covers adding video and editing video audio soundtracks that was the opening sequence of my latest AV show which if you've been following what's been happening on the forum I've been stripping video from a VHS C camera stock of videos, editing them and digitizing them so they can be used into normal pictures to exe show. This particular one was a, a holiday we had in Germany back in 1995, just over 17 minutes long, so I won't be able to convert this to an AV show that can be uploaded to one of the hosting sites. But I thought it might be of interest to beginners to, to pictures to exe to show them how I edited the audio and added it into the show. Right, first of all, I'll open the Audacity screen up. Here you can see the Audacity screen with the various components that are in this particular show. I'm just to want to try and make it a bit. First of all, we've got the music track first music track here then after 24 seconds the video audio track appears now I've lined these up in audacity so that I know exactly where the video audio track is to start and I've made that 24 seconds so that it's not a fraction of a second and it's easier to transpose that into pictures to exe there are also five music tracks. I separated the video audio track from the music tracks and added two separate tracks to Pictures to Exe. This gave me then the opportunity to be able to vary the sound levels of either track. If I'd have combined them all together I would have only been able to vary the audio on, on the, the master track. By doing it this way, I'm able to vary the sound level on the video track separately from the musical background. There are certain parts in the video that I wanted to hear the audio track. Most of it is rubbish, but there are a couple of sections where there's a, a guide talking um, when we visited Heidelberg, and I needed to have those to create the right effect for the show. Right, to add the audio tracks made in Audacity, first of all, in Project Options, it's shown here as track two, but it's actually the first track, the major track, which is the sound files, pick files, that go from slide one right to the end of the show, and it's or five seconds, 18 minutes or five seconds. And if I highlight that, you'll see that I've ticked the link to slide box there and linked it to slide one. When I did that with the video file, it didn't seem to work correctly. So what I did there was to highlight the video file, click on slide options and add the audio file there for that. I'll, I'll just demonstrate how I did that. If you click on add audio file, now th this is the folder that contain all the pictures for the show, stills and video, but you can't see them because down here you've got this box highlighted audio files. So you need to click on the drop down and click on video files. Now it's brought up thumbnails of the two video files. We've got one named Germany which is 656 megabytes which is the original stripped from the video. The second one is after it's been into pictures to exit and converted 
you'll see it's dropped down to 350 megabytes and it's uh, 16 minutes 52 seconds long so I'll highlight that there click open and now you see it's in there it's showing that audio file so really that that's about um, the sum of this particular tutorial I'll finish the section off with the usual manner Thank you.